I've been waiting a very long time for you, but you're not here. And with every passing day, every unappetizing meal, and every home doctor visit, I still dream of you coming to my door and reading me a bedtime story like you used to. You used to tell me, when I'm away, just look up at the sky, and I am there, amongst the stars. What good is that, when my whole universe is down here within these walls? Amy, honey, are you ready to go for a walk? No. No? We go on a walk every day. Yes, because it's good for you. What good is it for anymore? Don't say that. Can we try calling Dad again? You've reached Eric Friedman. If you are hearing this voicemail between 2031 and 2034, I am on a mission to Mars, and I have limited cell service throughout the year. And if this is Amy calling, just remember to always look up in the sky, pumpkin, and that's where you can see me. Godspeed. Leave a message after the beep. I've been waiting a very long time for you, but I can't reach you. Besides the obvious, there's some other pretty terrible things about being a sick kid. Prepare for bubbles! And make it... double. Honey, oh. this is Jesse and James. They must be from the... Excuse me, ma'am. We're professionals. Uh, we'll handle the introductions. No we offense. We are from the I Make a Wish Foundation. Ooh. We heard you, you wanted to make a wish. Ooh. Ooh. So, what's it gonna be? Anything you want. Anything. I want to see my dad. How does it trip to Disneyland sound? Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, where do we go? I don't know. It's six to one, half a dozen the other. What the hell does that mean? Creepy, watch out! Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god, Friedman, help me. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Friedman. Oh my god. I need you to do something for me. Anything. I need you to give this to her. Let's use it right now to save you, right now. It's not about me. It's for her, it's the whole reason I went on this mission. you no, we need to save you right now. She needs it more than me. Marco, listen. Not those guys again. No, wait, I think it might be the mail. I've been waiting a very long time for you, but I can't find you. Sometimes I get mail from you. I'm always hopeful it's a letter that says you'll be coming home soon. Although I am always disappointed by what the letters say, this one, this one in particular, was special. Cool. Obsidian. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> What's your name? Chibido. Is that all you say or is that your name? Chibido. Did dad send you? Chibido. What does he want you to do here exactly? Chibido. Okay, but we'll have to sneak you in. Because if mom sees you, she'll freak. Chibido. Let's go. And 
that's when I met him. He made a great first impression. I know he's an alien, but there was something so human about him. Why did you send him to me, Dad? I wish anyone could tell me. I've been waiting a very long time for you. But even though you're not here, Chibita is great company. We do so much together. Even though I feel weaker, Chibita always cheers me up. I've been waiting a very long time for you. Honey. And now, it's getting too late. It's a nice day out for a walk. I know you probably can't hear me. But... The doctor said there's a chance that you can. I just wanted you to know. It's a nice day. just like that, he was gone. I've been waiting a very long time for you. I thought you had sent me a friend. Thank you. I, I, I'm going to see my daughter. But what you sent oh. me was a shooting star. I'm going to see my daughter. And I already know what I'm wishing for. It's you. So, uh, like... So you guys are like real, um, crop circles, is that like, like, is that you? Cause they're like perfectly circular. I mean like humans need like compasses. Is that the word? Compasses? No. The, what are they called? The, the thingies that look like, you wouldn't know. I know. What about pyramids? Did you guys, do, is that you? Did you do that? Oh my gosh, I knew it. I freaking knew it. Because like they're so big. Like, Shut up! Gotcha. <laughs>